It's a project that costs more than $13 million, but the Route 66 Visitor Center is not yet getting the return on investment the city and the county hoped it would. So could a change of ownership of the Route 66 Visitor Center help revive this dream? News 13's Natalie Wattis has more. The vision for this visitor center has been in the books since probably previous to the year 2000. For some people in the community, most in particular the southwest area of Albuquerque, it's been a 30 year wait. Now, the visitor center is a reality off of West Central Avenue, but even now, it's not fully up and running. Currently, the visitor center operates under an IGA, which is an intergovernmental agreement. So both the city and the county have been responsible for the operations of the visitor center. But the latest change for the visitor center has to do with that ownership. So the item before you now is requested by the real estate department to authorize me, the county manager, to execute the donation agreement between Bernalillo County um, and the city of Albuquerque for the Route 66 Visitor Center. The Bernalillo County Commission voted Tuesday night to transfer the ownership of the center to the city of Albuquerque. At this point, really feels like maybe they don't have the capacity to carry it out to what it really needs to be and should be. Benya says the commission would transition to more of an advisory role. She says part of the reason for the change is the county can't get the licensing done to bring businesses like tap rooms and breweries into the event space. The city knows um, how to operate a, a visitor center. I mean, they do the Albuquerque Museum, they do Explora. I think they're more equipped and um, um, better poised to be able to just ensure that it becomes what the community has envisioned it to be the, so many years ago. Natalie Wattis, KRQE News 13. If all goes to plan, the county hopes the deal to transfer the property to the city of Albuquerque will be done by the end of March.